So I wanted to do a little update. I've bought something uh, which actually came from China. It's a mister which you can use on the CNC machine. Um, you connect it to a air hose via this uh, nozzle here and this pipe goes into a reservoir and if you get the pressure right and you twiggle all these things around uh, you can produce a fine mist. Um, I was going to just have a go and just see what this thing does. Uh, it actually feels really well made, uh, which is quite surprising. So the way I was going to do this was, really I should use a, a PVC tube, but I bought this um, PTFE one without realising how uh, inflexible it is. I'm just going to connect these two uh, pieces, a push fit piece here, and the um, nipple that fits onto the uh, compressor together. I'll use the compressor regulator to manage um, the flow. Uh, this piece only cost me a couple pounds. I managed to find uh, one part on eBay for a couple quid uh, and the other piece was actually in a reduced section in a tool store for a pound so uh, pretty pretty cheap, a lot cheaper than buying a regulator, an external regulator from the one on the compressor. This simply fits here. And the pipe goes in like that. So I've just filled up the tank. I just want to get an idea of how long it takes to empty using this nozzle. I mean, you probably don't even need to actually add a Missing liquid, uh, I mean, the air will the fact the air is moving at that speed will probably cool the bit just to like cool the bit somewhat. I've never used one of these before, so I don't know how, how much air you even need really. So, I'm thinking of fitting this long here and somehow reaching the nozzle around. Uh, the nice thing about this is the two holes are actually spaced 20 mil apart which is the same as the uh, gap between the extrusions. So once I put T-slot nuts in there it would be pretty straightforward to attach this on. The idea of using the compressor for that um, purpose didn't feel quite right. Um, I can imagine if it was constantly on for about an hour while I was cutting aluminium or something on the CNC machine, it would probably pack up quite quickly. Uh, Nathan let me borrow his um, compressor, uh, which is, it doesn't have a tank and it's just for a um, aquarium. Difficult to know whether this would actually work without like without filling the um, filling the water on.
So it works, but it does drip quite a lot. And I think that's because the pressure is not high enough, the velocity of the air is not high enough. Focus. Okay. So this could be a alternative to using an actual uh, compressor, tool compressor. Um, but I think this just isn't quite big enough. I think it needs to be able to f push a lot more air than it actually does. So this one actually does 70 litres a minute. Imagine if it was double that, it would actually uh, work. And I like the fact that this is actually quite quiet considering how loud the machine is anyway. I don't want to be adding more noise to the shop. <laughs> Please click on the information card at the top right corner of the screen for a playlist of CNC related videos. I will also provide information about the fittings and where I bought the spray block on my website which you can access in the description below.